Hello and thanks for watching Local Edition, I'm Eric Wattilla. The National Cherry Festival kicked off this past weekend, and while there are countless activities going on in Traverse City, many other local communities held their own festivities over the weekend. Vic McCarty explains. It's easy for the electronic media to focus on the National Cherry Festival in Traverse City year in and year out, but there are plenty of other Northern Michigan events going on in the first week of July or so. Here we go, even higher. In Lake City, for example, there's the greatest fourth in the north. We are the friendliest town around. On Beaver Island, there's quite possibly the most entertaining Fourth of July parade around. Eat raw honey, Beaver Island honey, it's good for you. And as we found out recently, Harbor Springs pulls out all the stops for its fourth. I'm here for tickets. I didn't know that. I'm here for tickets. Happy Fourth of July. <laughs> An estimated six to seven thousand people lining the streets for their July 4th parade last Saturday. We just like to come here and spend the day and we brought all our friends and we all match like little nerds, so it's fun. <laughs> Thanks to my mom. And this parade had really just about everything. How do you like the parade? What's your favorite part? Uh, the old ladies in the fake bikinis. And of course, it had the all-American hot dogs. All American hot dogs are wieners on parade. They are the best. It's our seventh year, and we have more dogs every year to chum join us. Wieners on parade. parade. The Harbor Springs festivities bringing in people from all over the nation, and it does so every single year. Uh, this is about my sixth year here in Harbor Springs, and uh, just the tradition, everything about Harbor Springs, uh, the festivities and the parade. It's just a great time to be down here, enjoy this beautiful day in uh, a great city. Now, with attention for the moment being focused on over there and facing that way for the parade, attention's already focusing over here and facing that way for the fireworks in Harbor Springs tonight. But there is more to the story because you can see Petoskey's fireworks from here too. Quite possibly the only situation in Michigan where you get to see two fireworks shows for the price of one. In Harbor Springs, for Local Edition, Vic McCurdy. Now, Eric, back to you. Thanks, Vic. Coming up next on Local Edition, I'll explain why our newscast is actually in its last week on the air. Stay with us.